Hi everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to calculate and how to get uh, SHA1 for your Flutter app inside Android Studio. Sometimes uh, for your development you need to have your SHA1 for your application. For example inside uh, Firebase if you want to integrate Firebase in your application, you need to have SHA1 for some specific parts of the uh, Firebase services. So inside Android Studio, you can actually calculate SHA1. For this purpose, you need to go to the project and at the top select the project and open your Android folder in the Flutter app. Go to app, go to source and main and find your Gradle file. Inside your Gradle file you click on open for editing in Android Studio. You can choose to open uh, inside this window or new window. I'm going to choose a new window. This is going to open a new uh, project, but it's going to open only Android part of your Flutter app. So it treats your app as Android, not Flutter, because SHA1 is on the Android side we need to have the Android Studio open with the focus on Android part of your application. So here you go to Gradle from the right side you open this. Okay inside here you have your Android and then you have Android again you open this branch you open Android you have signing report you just double click on signing report and this one is going to take some time to show you the SHA1 value of your application you will have your SHA1 and also MD5 value for your application. As you see, we have lots of segments for SHA1. The one that you need is variant release and config release. You need to have SHA1 in this section. So you just copy this uh, SHA1 and use it in your Firebase. The other one that you may need is debug variant and debug config. This one sometimes is needed if it is explicitly mentioned in the documentation. So you just copy these values and you just go back to your, you can close this window and you go back to your Flutter application. Thanks for watching and please subscribe for more videos on debugging and uh, tips for Flutter apps.